So what IDEs can you use to develop C++ programs? Well, off the top of my head, the, the IDE that I recommend that you guys use, especially if you're, on, if you're on Microsoft Windows, is Microsoft Visual Studio. And you can download Microsoft Visual Studio for free off the Microsoft website uh, for free. All you have to do is just uh, search, it up, search it up on Google and just download the Express, uh, the Express or Community Edition and you'll be able, be able to get a, a, a freeware version of Visual Studio for free. But if you're on the Mac OS X platform, um, I, I, you, can, you can also use uh, Xcode for the Mac OS X operating system. Uh, also for Windows, you can, you can also use Red Studio as well. Uh, it's not my favorite IDE because I've had to, I've had to, had to use Red Studio before and I find it very, um, there's not a lot of support for Rad Studio, so I, I really don't recommend Rad Studio, but that, that is another option. And another option is Codeblocks. Uh, it's a, I haven't really used Codeblocks myself, it's, 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 it's okay-ish. I've heard it's okay, but it's not, my, it's not my favorite one. And there's another one called uh, Dev C++, but I don't recommend that you use Dev C++ as, as because it, it is very, very outdated. Uh, I don't think it's been updated in over 10 years, I think, and um, it's, just, it's just a shit IDE, and I don't recommend that you use it. So if you're on the Microsoft Windows operating system, uh, I highly recommend that you please download uh, Microsoft Visual Studio, as because that's the IDE that, that we're, that we're going to be using in the following course modules. Okay guys, to create a project in Visual Studio 2019 edition, uh, Visual Studio 2019 uh, is the latest is the latest version of Visual Studio that's currently out on the market. So to create a a C plus plus project in Visual Studio twenty nineteen, uh, these are the following steps. So what we have to do is all we have to do is click on create a new project. Click on C plus plus and select. So we can select the languages that you've got installed in Visual Studio 2019. So what I want you guys to do is just click on C++. Uh, we're primarily, in this course, we're primarily going to be using running console applications. So what I want you guys to do is just click on console app. Next. Uh, name the project. So uh, in this example, we'll call it... Uh, Project test. So you can you can name it anything you want, and just click on create. And there we go. It's finally created a project. Uh, so by default, uh, it's created a hello world uh, basic project. Uh, so if you just click on, uh, what you can do is you can just go up the top here. Uh, Press. Uh, you can either press, you can either choose uh, start debugging or start without debugging. I prefer I prefer the second option of starting without debugging. So just press press Control F five or select this option here, and the and the program will run. There we go, guys. So that's how to create a project in Visual Studio twenty nineteen edition. Attention, computer science and engineering students. Are you tired of falling asleep in class while your lecturer spills out C++ gobbledygook? My name is Sahil Bora and I'm the founder and proprietor of the C++ Better Explained website. What I'm offering you guys today is my 87 page book that outlines how to quickly and master the fundamentals of the C++ programming language. If you've been searching around for free YouTube videos that, ha that haven't made any sense at all or free C++ tutorials online that have made you want to gouge your eyes out my book will put all of that to rest today because my book is written in a straightforward and direct manner using my learning tools such as analogies for dummies, visual code diagrams, and simple code documentation that will get you learning and understanding the C++ programming language in a matter of days. The book is $9 and what I want you guys to do is to click on the green button below and pick up a copy today. You will not regret this at all.